<sighs> Howdy. <sighs> My head hurts. Well, if I did what you did and fall through a hole in the mountain, I'm sure my head would be killing me too. Nah, that's not what it is, man. I've got a massive headache, proper hungover. Ow. I guess I got really drunk and fell down this goddamn hole. And you're a talking flower. Am I Am I still drunk or what? Nah, of course not. I'm your new friend. Okay. Just to get past any confusion here, I'm a genderless child, not a giraffe. Okay. No genitals. Thanks for sharing that. Okay, so how do I get out of here? My oh, way, friend, I'm your buddy now. Just walk into my little white seed thing. That doesn't sound right. Do it, friend, it'll teleport you right out of here. Ow! Just kidding. It's a killer kill. It's a kill or kill the world out there. Yeah, you got a mess little speech right now. Kill or kill, kill or kill the Why can't I say that? K kill or kill or be killed, world. Kill or kill B world. Yeah, prepare to die. To be fair, I would rather die right now considering how bad this headache is. Stay back, evil creature. Hadouken. <laughs> what are you doing here, small child? I'm a genderless small child. Thank you very much. I'm also vegan. Just throwing that out there. That's all you should know. You should know that. Well, I guess you're stuck down here forever now. Really? You ain't got like a spare jetpack lying around? I could just fly up there. I mean, you are quite hefty looking. I'm sure you could lob me up there, right? Dieting is hard. Oh no, no! Don't get me wrong. I like a bit of curve. I think. I mean, I am genderless, and I can't even fuck you because I got the genitals, so I don't even know. Whatever, just lob me up there. Looks a bit dangerous to me, small child. Just think of it as exercise. You'll get that beach body in no time. You think? No, but do it anyway. Three, two, one. Ah! Ah! Oh, shit, oh, God, ah! I'm sorry. What the hell? Well, I guess seeing that you're stuck down here, let's get back to my house. Do you usually take children back to your house? Bit creepy, not gonna lie. I'm just trying to keep you safe, child. By the way, you know that flower is following us, right? Ah, oh, shit. He's just one of the many monsters you might encounter on your travels. Now try conversing with this dummy. <laughs> what? Just stall it until I come and attack it. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, how'd your day go, Mr. Dummy? Good, keep going. How's the wife? You divorced? Ah, oh, shit. Did you know about this goat lady? No. You got a divorce last week. How could you not know this? Oh, no. You trying to make me talk to him? Yeah, he's going through a really depressing stage of his life. Like, do you want to talk to me? See, like, he doesn't even want to talk to me. Well, I'm sorry, dummy. We'll leave now. Yeah. Okay, I get it. I'm sorry, Mr. Dummy. I'll repent your privacy. We'll press on. Let's go, child. Too easy. Sorry to hear about your divorce, by the way. Call me. Okay, let's go through this spike room. Do you have to walk this every day? Why would you even want to walk this way? There's a grocery store back there. Like, why are you even there anyway? I just fancy taking a nice walk. Mmm, seems delightful. Okay, we take a right here and then... Uh, okay, maybe not... I uh, think it's a left here. Uh, oh, these silly spikes. <laughs> There we go, easy. Yeah, you've got a bit of red on you, a little bit. What? Forget it, it's fine. You've done excellent this far, child. Forgive me. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I don't really get what you're trying to... I am... Um... Yeah, I can see you! I can see... Oh my god, screw this. It's a six. I need to piss so bad. I've been holding this in for ages, man. Remember that one time you're running up and down like an absolute moron? Before that. Okay, just let me look at my purse. <sighs> hey, look what I found. This is kind of cute. I got this from the Monster Fair. Oh, my bladder. Come on. Okay, let me just... Oh, shit. Oh, what now? I can't find my keys. That's it. I can't hold it. I'm peeing up against this rock. I don't even care. <sighs> what are you doing, man? You're peeing on me! Is this rock talking to me? Yeah, the rock's talking to me. Get away from me! Hey, don't move, man. I'm trying to pee on no. you. Just, just stay still, man. Just, there you go. There you go. <sighs> Thank you. I feel so violated. Oh, wait. My door doesn't even have a lock on it. There we go. Come on in. This is some very interesting artwork. Yeah, snails. <laughs> Excellent news. I'm gonna hit the hay, so... Is there a bed in here, or...? No, no, don't go in here! <sighs> Hi, Steve, this is, uh... Genderless child. Genderless child. Genderless child, this is Steve, my boyfriend. <laughs> Pleasure. Anyway, the fair room's down here, bye! <laughs> oh, you're awake already, child? I literally didn't sleep. I haven't seen you in about three seconds. I baked you a pie, child. Eat it! How did you even manage to cook that so fast? Eat it! Ugh! What is in this? Snail. Snail pie. You gotta be joking. Wait, where's Stephen? Oh, Stephen. He left. Story time! There once was a snail in the land of snails who loved other snails. I'm guessing all the characters are snails, right? Snails! 
Pay that to yes. Do you see the thing with snails is even though they love other snails, 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 snails. Where are you going, little child? Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave. I appreciate the hospitality and everything, but I've got to get home, man. Because if I don't, my dad's gonna beat me again. And I don't want to miss that. This is the way out, right? Hold on, before you do that! <laughs> She is one strange MILF goat. Did I really just say that sentence, MILF goat? What is wrong with me? Help me! Okay, what the hell was that? Toriel? What is this all about? Hello? Help ah! Yeah, see, I would, but I'm really lazy and pretty selfish, so um, I'm gonna leave. So enjoy the rest of your life, I guess. Help What are you doing? Oh, oh, oh. well, that was embarrassing. Took you a while to get down here, so I got bored. So my plan was to come down here and break this door so you couldn't get through, but I couldn't do it because I'm too weak. Then I don't want to hurt my nails. I just got them done yesterday. You haven't even got any nails. It's amazing what the imagination can do. As I said, I appreciate the hospitality. Now, can I go through, please? Of course, you would block my entrance like that. I can't allow you to go through. If you go through, you'll die. And if you die, I won't have anyone to read stories to. Why were you taking pictures of yourself, by the way? Oh, it's from Instagram. I mean, if you wanted to, I could take a photo for you. You'd do that for me? Yeah, if you follow and like my page. Genderlessgoon underscore 92. Okay, done. All right, give me that then. Thank you. I just stand there. That's it. That's it. Now look fierce. Yeah. There you go. Do, uh, do some jun jumping jacks. Jumping okay. Jacks, there we go. Silly face. Nice, nice. Sexy pose. Like like this? Like Not that sexy. That's just weird. Now you're a gorilla. That's it. That's it. They are movements. Yes. Backward shot. Turn around. Face that way. Okay. Am I doing this right? Am I Son of a bitch? I'm hungry as balls, man. Well, well, if it is a Mr. Genderless Child. That makes no sense saying Mr. Genderless Child, because the whole point of it is that I'm genderless, so I'm neither Mr. or a Mrs. I'm a mystery. End my life. Well, I would, child, but this world is kill or kill B world. Kill you got any food? Uh, what? You know, food. You consume it. I'm hungry. Oh, not on me, no. All right. See you then. Uh, but don't you want to hear about my demonic plan? Nope. But my plan is... I don't think you understand... La, 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 I'm a la, flower. La, la, la. <laughs> Joke's on him, I got a chocolate bar. Hey! Give that back, you piece! I'm gonna get you... <laughs> what an asshole. Is this the right way, or am I going... Alright then. <sighs> oh my god, it's cold! My nips are like proper wrecked. <laughs> I've never seen my nips this big before. Yeah, you better stay away, demons. I'll stab you with my sword nips. <laughs> <sighs> oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> Hello? I wouldn't recommend attacking me. Unless you want your eyes poked out by my nips. <sighs> Human, don't you know how to create a new pal? Turn around. Okay. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in my hands trick! Oh, never mind. That was just me. I shot myself! <laughs> that smells so bad. Yeah, good thing I wear diapers then, ain't it? <laughs> You're proper weird. Oh, shit, me brother's coming here. Take this lampshade, pretend to be a lamp. Like this? Am I a lamp now? Absolute lamp. Brilliant. Hi, Sans. Yeah, how's it going, Papyrus? Hey, why couldn't the skeleton go to the prom? Because he had no body to go with. Nah, mate, because he was ugly, fat, and no one liked him. <laughs> Oh, that was just me lamp. Oh, okay. I'm going back to my puzzles now. They're pretty bonerific, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Kill me. How's it going, lamp boy? <laughs> Not bad. Always wanted to be a lamp at some point in my life. Definitely filled that desire today. You know, me brother's never seen a human before. Aside from porn, of course. You guys do some weird shit. Speaking of shit, I'm really enjoying your smell. So I'm going to not go smell it over there. Hey, excuse me, could you change my diaper for me, please? Oh, hello, doggy. Who's a good boy? Who's a good little doggy? Oh, God! I used to like dogs until today. Oh, you're right. Oh, not you again. Is, is that what I think it is? Dug into course here, but look in front of it. It's a giraffe! I'm not a giraffe! I'm a genderless child. Uh it's a human. Oh a human! What well, if I capture this human? Then in dying the fish thing might promote me! So you're trying to impress a fish. Your life sounds tragic. I'll have some puzzles in store for you. <laughs> <coughs> Shit! You know your brother's an absolute goon, right? Yeah, go easy on him. Is it a tough life? How so? Well, he started doing cooking classes recently. 
Sounds hard, man. Don't you worry, though. I'll go tell the starving African kids how hard this guy's life is compared to theirs. Good one. Well, I'll see you up ahead. Gonna head to town. Go to pub. Might get you a drink. You have me at pub. I could use a drink so bad. I'll see you there. Let's go. Oh, I hold up. Hi. We're evil dogs and we're gonna kill you. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. You've arrived, human! Try and beat my puzzle if you can! You're not interested, mate. Uh, hold on! <laughs> okay, try and get past this puzzle! Damn it! Hold on, child! <laughs> try and... Try and get past this, child! I'll see you at the pub. I hate my life! Now, about that drink. Yes, lads, drinks on me. Let's get smashed! I've been waiting for you, child. Can you not yell? It hurts. You see, I actually like giraffes. However, and guy wants a nice giraffe slash human to add to her zoo. Yeah, I'm just going to walk past you because you're about as useful as an ass-flavored lollipop. Unless you're into eating ass and you enjoy the taste, then I won't judge. I guess it's come down to this. Taste my pain! Nice going. What a dodge. Eat this! You're really good at this. How is he dodging my attacks like this? Is it because you you don't want to fight me? Yeah, sure, that's what it is. Wow, does this mean that we are friends? I mean, I don't hate you, but I don't necessarily really enjoy you that much either. Like, I probably wouldn't go to your funeral if you died, but I probably would show up if you had a party going on. Do you know what I mean? That kind of friendship zone. You are a wonderful human. I'll let you pass. Oh, well, thank you very much. You have a good day now. Would you like to hang out sometime? No. How about a date? I'm a genderless child. I don't even know how we would even fornicate. I have bones. Look, I'm not interested. Sorry. Are you enjoying the date so far? We're not on a date. You make me feel like a cool dude. Definitely likewise. Do you put out on a first date? Just wondering, because I definitely would. Can you go away? This date is wonderful. Please stop. I think I'm in love. Shut up. Oh, my. Oh. Are you okay? Papyrus, if you're not dead, then say something. If this was an accident and I didn't push you, don't say anything. I'm glad we got that cleared up. Ugh, shouldn't have drank that much at the bar. Need a piss again. Oh, here we go. <sighs> What's that noise? A human? <sighs> this piss is so long, it's like a never-ending story. Go. Were you watching me the whole time? Yes. Excellent news. Ice cream. Ice cream. Oh, shit. Oh. Damn it. Oh, excuse me. I think you dropped your little spear thing. Yeah. Uh, it's okay. I'll, I'll throw it back. Don't worry. That's not a good idea. I, I don't think. Oh, oh. I'm going to assume you're mad. Got you now, you little freak. Well, he's gotta be around here somewhere. Damn it! My weakness! I scream, 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 I scream! <laughs> Why are you following me, man? Isn't Undyne so cool? I guess for a fish, she's alright. How did she even get down here? Did she die and someone flushed her down the toilet? Possibly. That's how I got here. Of course it is. So what does that make you? A toilet baby? I hope so. So where's the exit to this place? Just follow me. By the way, it's gonna start raining for no reason in a second. Up, oh, right on cue. Here's an umbrella. Cool. Do you want pink or blue? What does it matter? I can't tell if you're a girl or a boy. I don't have a gender. Stop oppressing me. Fine, I'll take pink. I am comfortable with my sexuality. What does that even mean? What do you find attractive? Bananas or something? Apples. Oh, silly me. Of course that makes sense. God damn it. He's supposed to open the umbrella, by the way. Oh, I know I forgot something. The only way is up there, so to get up you have to jump on my head. Or we could A, get a ladder, B, I climb, C, I can probably jump up there to be honest. No, you gotta jump on my head. You seem pretty adamant about this whole head jumping thing. It's the only way. Alright, fine. <sighs> oh yeah. Ew. Safe travels. Yeah! I've got you now! Yeah! What is that? Huh? The nya thing! Oh, that's my catchphrase. I mean, to me it just sounds like a cat being stepped on, but to each their own. I should probably run away now, right? <laughs> Mine. 
Did you just cut the floor in half? Yes. Okay, not gonna lie, that was actually really dumb considering I'm at a dead end and you can easily capture me no problem at all. But now you slice the floor in half, I'm gonna fall, so... Oh, screw it. Ah! <sighs> I guess that was kind of stupid. Ah, uh, looks like I'm okay. Never mind. Okay, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> oh, love and life. Now where am I? The garbage disposal. At least I found dinner. <laughs> you are so gonna come to life, aren't you? You are just gonna. <laughs> I called it. I called it. Whoa, I'm a spooky ghost that lives inside a dummy. Whoa. I'm going to kill you. Why? Because I'm an angry ghost thing. Why are you so angry? You wouldn't care. To be fair, I probably wouldn't. Why don't men find me attractive? I don't know. Maybe just don't possess a dummy. Because I only have one possession left. Oh, I know a loophole for that. Try possessing this thing. Why? Just trust me, it's gonna solve all your problems. Okay. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you possessed a really heavy box, and now you can't move. And you're gonna be trapped there forever. Have a wonderful life. You doomed me! S H O P shop. Better have chicken strips in here, I swear. Hmm, so do you own the store or. Yeah? How do I pay? Because you can't really. Oh, yes, another store! Hoi, welcome to the tent shop! What's the best item you've got? We, uh, have these things, hoi! Why are you talking like an absolute mongatron? Because our hoi fan base weeaboos will like it! Interesting. How much do they cost, by the way? Per hour, that is. Oh, that depends, sir. You can pay per song or. Ah, okay. We go about doing it a lot of different ways, you see. Gotcha. How much is that thing again? Is, uh, one million money things. One million? That's a ripoff. I, er, uh, has go college. For what? Speech therapy? <laughs> Whatever, I'm going. Ugh, <sighs> customer's gone, guys. Take five. Oh, never mind. Actually, you know what? I'll take it. Hoi. <laughs> And I'll take you guys as well. Ah! He just killed my little troop thing! We were gonna play at weddings and everything! When I get your soul, we can finally go to the surface. What's so good about the surface anyway? We don't have any McDonald's down here. To be fair, I can relate to that. Oh yeah! I'm gonna stab you and stop. So now if you what are you doing? What is that? That's my theme song. Well, if that's the case, then why'd you kill my little troop thing? They could have sang that for you. All right. Do you know what I'm saying about you thinking things through? I know. You've got to work I, on that. I know. You've really got to work on it. Hey! Get back here, you little shit! You all right, mate? How's it going? Yes, lad. Down it, down it. <sighs> Bye, buddy! How's it going, Undyne? Fuck off! How rude! It's too hot! Uh, this armor! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> like fish in a barrel! Actually, hold on one second. Perfect! Need water! Sorry, what? I, I can't hear you. Need water! Sorry, I can't hear you? What are you, what are you trying to convey to me? I need water! Oh, you want to apologize to me for trying to kill me? Water! This is the problem with you guys down here. You're always trying to kill me. You have a go at me if I attack you back, but you're the one trying to kill me. Oh, whatever. <laughs> here, here's your precious water. Ah! This is boiling water! You didn't specify what kind of water you wanted. Ah, it's eating my fish! Yeah, crawl back to your fish tank. Go on. Crawl away. It's so ungrateful. Uh... Okay, let's weigh my options here. There could be food in there, but I could potentially die. But if I don't go in, I probably might have a better chance of living. But at the same time... Ah, uh, uh, shit, not again. It's worth the risk. Hello? Anybody? What the... Oh, my God. Am I in the Truman Show? No, this is Big Brother Season 10. <laughs> and what are you supposed to be? The dinosaur version of Lisa Simpson? My name is Elvis, and I'm a scientist of Asgore. As 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 mm. Asgore? Mm. Oh, you know, Asgore. You know, he's a villain. You know, he wants to take your soul, so he takes you up to the surface, and then he goes and gets some KFC. <laughs> I could really do some KFC right now, to be honest. I make robots. Hi, I'm the robot. He's a robot. I'm going to ask you some questions, and if you don't answer them correctly, you'll die. That went from a 2 to a 10 pretty quickly. What is my favorite color? Um... 
Oh, isn't the sky so blue? Uh, uh yeah, sure. Oh, I also love how blue the ocean is. <laughs> Do you like a bit of ocean in the morning? Why not? I love how the Nazis had blonde hair and blue. Eyes. To be fair, they were masters of fashion. Answer my question or you'll die. I'm not sure, Mr. Robot Friend. Megatan. Megatron. There's just so many wonderful colors, you know? You should learn to appreciate them all. I have a pair of shoes that are blue. Alphys, I know it's blue. Stop. It's a correct answer, blue. The correct answer is Magnolia. Good job, Alphys. I need to go find a knife or something to kill you with, so I'll be our bay. La, 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 la. I like the blue block in Tetris. Get out of my life. What the... Hello? Hello? How did you get- I, I didn't even have a phone! Yeah, I stuck one in your pocket while you weren't looking. Don't call me again. Jesus. Oh my god. Hello? Can you stop tagging me on Twitter, please? Sorry. <laughs> oh my gee. That also includes text messaging, Facebook, Tumblr, Monstergram, Steam, and stop commenting on my YouTube videos that I loaded four years ago saying that I look cute in denim! Sorry. <laughs> That's it. Wow, well, hey, that was so weird. I was just texting you. Did you get my invented light? Yeah, the event's been cancelled. Oh, what is this? Oh, oh wait, that's right. I killed Alphys, didn't I? And I still don't regret it. Well, I guess I got to use those platforms to spin across, but that is so much effort, and I'm just not in the mood for that. Oh, a plot device. He's a good doggy. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, doggy. I just, uh, I'll just tip him across. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry. Oh, hi. Oh, great. If it isn't Goonatron. Megaton. More like a waste of robot parts. Am I right, lads? You are right, lad. Cheers, lad. So what are you doing? Boiling some oil or something? Yeah, um, you're a lot earlier than I expected. I was going to have you participate in my cooking show. Why? Because I'm kooky. Can you pass me those eggs over there? I don't see why not. Oops, I slipped. I'm such a clumsy individual. But this isn't working how I planned. Okay, I'm gonna fly up here, and you use this jetpack and take me up to get the prize. If you don't do it, I'll kill you. How's that sound? Yeah, that sounds awesome, man. I'm definitely down for this. Are you ready? Come and get me! Did you hear what they said? Oh, that study about 70% of men being grubbers not showers, right? They said a child wearing striped pajamas will walk through here. I mean, it's more of a t-shirt, but technically you could use it as pajamas. I use t-shirts as pajamas. Is that weird? I don't think it's weird. Apparently they're scared of spiders. Is that so? And apparently they're really stingy with their money. Let me stop you right there. Are you getting this information from my Facebook profile? Uh, no. No. Because I haven't updated that in years. So if you're basing that whole stingy thing off that status that I was tagged in, that was actually sarcasm because I pay for that guy's birth that day. It's like reverse, you know, because I paid for his whole thing, so he was like, oh, you're so stingy, even though obviously I paid for everything. So it's just a joke, you know what I mean? So that's wrong. As for the spider thing, I'm not scared of spiders anymore. I actually love spiders now. Oh, Muffet added you as a friend. You just add me as a friend by accident. My finger slipped! Yeah, all right then. Oh, liking my profile pictures now, huh? My oh, fingers... let me guess, your finger slipped. You're not going any further. I can't wait to eat you. By the way, you know that story that I just told you about me not being scared of spiders anymore? Yeah. I lied! <laughs> La -da -da -dee -da 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 -da. Tragic tale of oh great. Oh Romeo! Oh Rome! Why won't you acknowledge my existence? Oh mate, fancy seeing you here! Hey, it's the bone face man skeleton dude who buys free drinks and stuff. That's my nickname around these parts. You alright, mate? Oh, how's it going, bone face skeleton dude who buys free drinks and stuff? Good, thanks, mate. See ya. Told ya. So, uh, I've got a matter that I've got to discuss with you, child. If it's concerning the bill, do not worry. I definitely will not be paying for any of it. Nah, mate, nah. I see you've been killing some residents down here. Those are all accidents. Are you kidding me? Very clumsy people down here. <sighs> well, all I'm gonna tell you, mate, is that if you keep going on the way you're going, you are gonna have a bad time. Because the way you're drinking, you'll be so hungover. This is going to be absolutely awful. Bad times all around. I'll drink to that. Cheers. Cheers. Let's get smart. Well, this could be a problem. You know what? I'm going to risk it for a chocolate biscuit. 
Vanania. Whoa. Hey, ya! Uh. Oh, can you just not? It's funny. Alphys is actually a really big bitch. Trust me, I'm fully aware. Are the traps and the lasers and shit? She reactivated. Cool. And she wanted to be part of your adventure. Well, I mean, that's kind of irrelevant now. Why? Alphys is dead. Why? Yeah, she was walking, tripped over, fell on the phone, went straight through her skull. Very unfortunate. But I wanted to kill Alphys. I mean, you never know. She might have survived. Try calling her. Okay. No answer. That's a shame. Regardless, you're a dick, so I'm gonna kill you anyway. Somehow I just knew you were gonna say that. Witness my transformation! So what are you now? The non-pedophilic version of Michael Jackson? I am fabulous! That's very stereotypical and offensive to gay people everywhere. I'm not even gay! Well then, it's just offensive in general. Actually, you know what? I take that back. You take that back? Yeah. You see, when I was at school, I had a teacher, and she taught me, you should never judge someone based on the way they speak, because they can't help how they speak, they can't help where they're brought up. Same time, though, that teacher was a rhino that escaped the zoo. Nobody can understand her apart from her son, who's in the same class as us. She'd be like, Grr! Some reason he could talk English. Pretty impressive for a rhino child, though, I'll tell you that. Okay, I'm convinced. That's what I thought. Have a good day. You too. I'll rub it up. I'll rub it up. Salty. That's sweet. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I like it. Uh -huh. Hi, I like in this black and white house. You know, you're lucky I didn't get a restraining order against you. Or I can add that to my collection, child. I can't even get 20 yards in front of Beyonce. To be fair, our ass takes up that much space. I got a story for you, child. You see, a while ago, a human fell down here and... Will you stop walking up when I'm telling my story? Sorry, I'm just really hungry. I'm looking for food. Here, take this. Uh, uh, here's the deal. If I give you this, you've got to sit down and listen to my story. Ugh. The story ends anyway with the conclusion being that you by Jack Deox. I'll take that as a compliment. Uh, stupid giraffe. Hello? Moses? Anyone of religious descent? Would you like to hear the powers of Jesus Christ? Um, Just kidding, mate! Ha ha ha! Tell you what, my head is pounding. It's like someone got a hammer right and my head is my ex-wife and they're just smashing it over and over. I'm guessing that's why she's an ex-wife. Anyway, as goes up ahead, mate, this will be the biggest challenge you've faced. Will you leave the underground or will you go back to the surface? Oh. The surface, obviously. Oh, no, mate. I was just trying to make it more, you know, dramatic or whatever. Very dramatic. Almost as dramatic as your sex life. Whoa, oh, hey! Well, I mean, I say dramatic, but there's no drama there because it's non-existent. Whoa! <laughs> He's done me! You know what, Sans? I legit thought you were the biggest loser ever at first. Oh, cheers, mate. You know what? You're actually all right. <laughs> You're going to make me cry, buddy. Please don't cry, please. <laughs> Sans, don't... Oh. <laughs> yeah, you just ruined it. You've ruined it. You've just... You've ruined it. Ah! <laughs> I'll be there in a sec, honey. Keep yourself warmed up till I get there. <laughs> oh, I am. Don't worry. Uh, where's the maid? I have no idea, but I'm sure she's in bed right now feeling very unsatisfied. Sorry, I was watering my flowers. Anyway, howdy. Would you enjoy a cup of tea, by the way? I don't drink tea. I have some vodka in the fridge. Would that do? You read my mind. That's dandy. Follow me. Wow, what is this? This is what keeps us all trapped underground. Well, then. So where's the vodka? Oh, I lied to get you in here. You son of a bitch! So now I must kill you. You kill me, I'm gonna kill you! You lure me in here with promises of vodka and there's nothing! How dare you! You know what, screw you, I'll be right back. Okay. Are you coming or what? Not now, mate lady. Such a jerk. Guess who's back? Now you must die. Your flowers are all gone. Huh? Yeah, I just stand on them all. What? Now we're even. This, this wounds me so. So that is how it is. The entire underground devoid of hope. The future had once again be taken. I just want to read comic books all day and play Nintendo. Well, damn, I mean, I love a bit of Mario Kart. If I give mercy on you, will you play me? And if I win, you've got to buy me that bottle of vodka. That sounds like a wonderful idea. Hmm? What the balls is that? <laughs> My free vodka! You idiot! Did he seriously just die from you? A flower? What was his name again? Asgore? More like Asgore. Am I right, lads, or am I right, lads? You are right, lad. I know I'm right, lads. In this world, it's kill or kill, be killed, kill, be kill world. You need to learn how to construct a sentence. Now I got other human souls, and if I kill you, child, I'll be a god. Now watch my demonic television. What is this? It's my own TV show. It's called Flowey the TV Show. My wife is doing really good, thank you. Excellent. How many episodes are there? 72. Hey, Dan, I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, I'm not really much of a binge watcher, to be honest. You're gonna sit here, child, and watch my TV show. Okay. Kill, kill be world. 
Kilo, kill, kill, be well, kilo, kill, kill. Oh, kill me. No. Why, no. Daffodil? Why did you shoot me? Did the Daffodil really kill that rose? I don't know. I guess you'll see in the next episode, child. I tell you what, I'm getting proper into this. It's quite quiet, though. Do you mind if I turn up a little bit? Go ahead, child. Yay. Oh, no. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? You press the action button. Are you serious? I'm really sorry, man. I was just trying to turn the volume up. No. <laughs> Flowey, I... Legit, I didn't mean to do that. I'm actually really liking the TV show. I reckon if you put this on Netflix, it'd be a massive hit. Uh, you really think so? 100%. Well, I guess I'll see you then. <sighs> We're finally here. The way out of the underground. This has been one hell of a journey. But now it's time for me to go home. What? Hello? Where am I? You are in underground heaven! Where now? You can live in eternity with us! No. Yes! Everybody you killed will be here! Look! It's your cat from when you were a child! <laughs> He's happy to see you! Oh, I gotta tweet this out. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! Can someone please kill me? It would appear you are already dead! Giraffe child! You get to spend more time with us! <laughs> what a lucky individual! All my buddies in hell are so jealous right now! Do you tag them and everything as well? No, they'll block me! Oh yeah, shit, why didn't I think of that? Either way, I'm going for a piss, I'll see you guys later! But in heaven, there is no need for urination! It was an excuse to get away from you! Oh! I would expect nothing less from my first ever boyfriend! Well, aren't you generous though? Like Holly P! Trust me, you don't want to know. <gasps> What is this light? It shines brighter than a telescope. Where will if it isn't the genderless child? Flowey, no, no way. Can you get me out of here, please? <laughs> Maybe. Seriously, man, you've got to get me out of here. I'll do anything. I'll, I'll water your leaves and I'll do your laundry, polish your leaves, whatever. Ah, it's ironic how the tables have turned now, child. But I got to admit, thanks to you, I got my Netflix and Amazon video deal. My show's got five stars on the Netflix. Uh, actually, on Netflix, it caters to your viewing preference, so the five-star number just represents stuff you watch, for example. Uh, sorry to be a downer. What was your name again? Flowey? Yeah. You want to be friends? How about a date? Hey, what about me being your boyfriend or whatever? I've moved on. I don't want a child anymore. I want a real flower. Flowey, run. And take me with you. I'm only supposed to do this to the children who don't kill anybody. But for you, I'll make an exception. Yes, yes, I love exceptions. They're my favorite type of exceptions. I'm gonna let you out now, child. But on two conditions. Conditions? Oh, how exciting! <laughs> the first being you can't kill anything down in the underground. And that includes kids. Killing the power into my television set and or Xbox. I run them simultaneously, you see. Excellent. What's the second one? The second I get you out of here, you're going to sit down and listen to my demonic plan. Do we have a deal? Yes. yes. <laughs> yeah, go on then. All right. Hold on to your britches. Nothing is happening. Well, that was just for effect. Here we go. Oh, sweet, I'm alive! Yes, you are, child. Now take a seat over there. All right, calm down, Chris Hansen. Now, where do I begin? See, my plan was to actually... Are you kidding me? Food. 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 Frog it. Ew, what the hell are you? Ow! You little shit! No! Huh? Ah, oh, you've killed me! Oh, God, please, why? I'm heartbroken. <laughs> Just kidding, mate. The Bible was actually useful for once. Oh, I love a bit of Bible in the morning. That's my favorite sci-fi novel. Listen, mate, put that knife away. You can't kill this thing. Well, why not? He's trying to kill me. Well, if you do, you'll end up back in the weird heaven, which means you'll never be able to hear any of my jokes again. And that sounds like a punishment worse than death. Here, what do you call a skeleton that beats the kids? Your mom. How do you know that? But nah, it's actually my stepdad. <laughs> frog it. Ow! This frog is doing my head in. Take mercy on it. Yeah, I'm trying, mate, but it keeps inappropriately licking me. Ow! Don't give in to the anger, my friend. Frog it. Ouch! You little shit! I'm gonna stab you so hard! Frog it. Why, oh, so cute. Just kidding, mate. What is wrong with you? Just keep telling it your skeleton jokes and it'll want to kill itself. Good idea. What's the difference between a skeleton and a baby? Frog it. I don't set the skeleton on fire. Frog <laughs> Okay, well, this plan isn't working. Good joke, by the way. 10 out of 10. Cheers. Is, mate, it's based on a true story. Ow! I'm so over this frog. BRB! I'm Mr. Genderless Child. I think I can do whatever I want. Hey! Are you froggy, froggy, froggy? You hungry, boy? Or girl? And yes, I just assumed your gender. Get triggered. Frog it. Here you go, pal. Frog it. Nah, nah. Ah! He 
He's choking! Say PR! No, 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 don't actually- Oh my god, you idiot. Here we go, plan D. Hey, Froggy, you want some food? You want the food? Frog it. Go get the food! Frog it! Frog it! Well, I didn't kill him. What? I, I, how have I got a phone again? Don't question it, mate. Hello? Ah, hi, human. Oh, hello? This for you, mate? Of course it is. Go on, ask him. Ask him. Go ask him. Ask him. Ask, ask him. Yeah. Ask him. Yeah, so, uh, uh, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, uh, please, uh, yeah, uh, uh. Let me guess you want to go on a date. No, yes. Oh, God, I was just kidding. Can you meet me in the bars outside of Snowden? No. Please? No. Please? Yes. Oh, my God, really? No. Listen, buddy, old pal, I love you and all that shiznit, but you're going to start being nicer to people, or monsters, and tables, because if you're not, you're going to end up back in that heaven again. And if you're there, you can't hear my skeleton jokes, and that sounds like a punishment worse than death. You said that twice now? Yeah! I thought we talked about this, the whole Nya thing. Oh, that was me. That was my new cat. Say hi, Freckles. Nya! That was so definitely her. Yeah, I think so too, mate. Definitely was. Yeah. Hi, baby cakes! The barber says hi, by the way. Tell him to kill himself. Mate! Tell him I said, don't kill yourself. The child says, don't kill yourself. Oh, I was thinking about doing it earlier. Now you persuaded me not to. I should have kept my mouth shut. Such a wonderful human. Okay, well, this has been really fun, but I gotta go now. Oh, you're busy? Yeah, I've gotta mow the lot. You know what? Just fuck you. Oh my god, being nice to people is awful. That's why alcohol was invented, mate. And diapers. It's like all my bad vibes just come out of me ass. But when I don't change, the bad vibes stay there, so... What a lovely image. Well, <laughs> just felt some bad vibes then. <laughs> Excellent. Basically, I'm talking about poo. Yeah, like, I, I poo got himself. it. Yeah. Poo. Yeah. 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 Shit. Just be nice to people. Be a nice guy. Ta -la -la! This is gonna be difficult. Do you wanna ride my butt? What did you just say? Do you wanna ride my boat? Well, I did until you started speaking. La -la -la -la! What is that? That's my character trait thing. Come on, get on my boat. I won't touch you, I swear. What did you say? -la -la! This is gonna be a bad idea. So do I pay you for the fare or what? Tra -la -la! The boat ride is free! Tra -la -la. So how do you make any money? Money? Yeah, I mean, if you're giving rides up and down every day, how do you support your wife and kids? Oh, I don't. They just starve. Tra -la -la. Well, how about this then? I'll be your manager. Manager? Yeah, so we charge people for the ride, split the profits. I get more, obviously, because of my boatman expertness. And you can use your small portion of profit to buy your wife some nice things. That does sound pretty useful. I could do with an air freshener. My wife has been smelling pretty bad recently. Why is that? She doesn't wear deodorant. No, no, her corpse is like three years old. Hmm. I can see how that could hinder your relationship. Yeah, the sex is awful. I have to do all the work. Ta -la -la, here we are. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look, we got a customer. Hi. Hi, ta -la -la. Can you take me to Applebee's? Yeah, sure. That'll be, um, what's the currency down here? Jeez. What does that mean? Gill? Gold? Goat's milk? Grambities. Grambities, all right. Ten grambities, please. Here, take my grambities. Thanks, I love grambities. Away we go. Ta -la -la. Ten grambities. Thank you. Ten grambities. Thank you. Thank you. Grambities. Thank you. Ten grambities. Thank you. That'll be have ten grambities. You too, mate. Ten grambities. Yeah. Thank yeah, you, mate. Thank you. Yeah. Grambities. Thank you. Man, we've made a lot of grambodies today. I love grambodies, tell a lot. All right, so if you drop me off at Snowden, you head back and get another customer while I count on money. Sound good? Sounds great. Perfect. Tell a lot. What an idiot. Oh, not you, the, the boat guy. Can I... Uh, nothing's ever easy, is it? You better move, dog, or I'm gonna put you in a kennel and only feed you once every two days. Yeah, I will go there. Be nice, small child. Shut up, Sands. Sorry, mate. Be nice, be nice. Um... There you go. It's a good dog. Ah! What, you don't like that? I thought dogs love getting kicked in the head. Ow! This is bullshit. How can I be nice to things if they're stabbing me in the leg? Try complimenting it, mate. Everybody loves compliments. How are you doing this? Are you God? Pretty much, mate. All right, let's do this. You've got a nice fluffy coat that I'm sure will make a nice rich woman happy one day. Ow! Just because you know it's true. Wait, hold on a minute. Boatman! I want to go down this river slightly. Sure, no problem. Ha! Take that, you metallic strange dog! Never thought I'd say that sentence in my life, but here we are. Did you count the money, by the way? Yeah, yeah, I counted it all. It's all good. It's on the other side of the river. Okay, thanks. Tra -la. And people say I'm not nice. Oh, did something move? Was it my imagination? Yeah, we'll go with that because I really can't be bothered to fight you right now. I am so sick of dogs, you have no idea. Are you a human? Because if you are, I'll make sure you'll never walk again. Oh, that's fine then, because I'm a banana. So we want to be friends? Not really. We're friends now. You like dog biscuits, brah? Can't say that I do. I tried them once, though, by accident. Thought it was cereal, you know. Poured them all in my bowl, added a bit of milk, and when I realized they were dog biscuits, oh man, did I feel silly. You must have felt pretty silly. It was so silly that I actually felt pretty silly. Okay, I'm done talking to you. Can I go now? So you like dog biscuits. Were well, you not paying attention to my story? The cereal escapade, we'll call it. Yeah, but I got special dog biscuits. Oh yeah, what's so special about them? Come on, let me show you. Where are you gonna take me? A crack house? I was joking. You call it crack house, I call it the overdose house. Yeah, that sounds way better. You coming in? <sighs> 
Yeah, probably not, honestly. Be nice, mate, or I'll tell you a bunch of jokes. <laughs> Alright, fine, give me the biscuit. <sighs> this is an actual dog biscuit. Well, yeah, what'd you think it was? You guys are actually smoking biscuits. Yeah. Did you watch somebody on Cringe Channel do it or something, and now you're trying to replicate them? Because if so, you've succeeded. How dare you mock my dog biscuits? I'm gonna fight you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? I can't see! How many fingers am I holding up? Uh, four. Duh! My nose! What are you doing? Alright, I'm sick of being a god now. There we go. What are you doing? What? I didn't kill him. Just whacked him in the schnoz a bit, you know. Screw the system, that's what I say. <sighs> oh, I'm gonna hurt you so bad. <laughs> Look, I'm trying to be nice, Sans. But it feels like to be nice down here, you have to either be a little bitch, lie to people, and smoke dog biscuits and get biscuit cancer. Because he attacked me, I was being nice. I've made effort here, man. This whole pacifist thing you want me to do, it's not right, and it goes against human nature. Mic drop. Yeah, see where you're coming from, mate, but, uh, I don't give a shit, because to get this last ending, you've got to be really nice to people and stuff, so, mwah, wrecked. Fine. Go! Oh, my nose! And by the way, I'm not a banana. I'm actually a human. No! Yeah, hi, is this the police? I'm starting outside a crack house right now. Yeah, they're all junkies. There's this one who's a bit drunk, I think. Very disorderly. Try to attack me. You can come arrest him if you want. Sweet. There we go. How's that for being nice? If you can't beat him, don't join him. Call the police. Have a lovely day. <gasps> I'm gonna get you! Underground News! Police received an anonymous tip. Dog biscuits, dogs, and more dogs. The house has been contained. All in a day's work. I'm liking this nice thing. And now the dogs have all been put down. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't win. <sighs> Hello! Yeah! Great, just when I thought life couldn't get any worse. Um, so, I have a favor to, uh, ask you. Why are you all timid all of a sudden? Oh, because I'm wearing my casual clothes, so now my personality's different. That's called bipolar disorder. How about you? Are you different now? I love you! That's a no. Can you, uh, deliver this, uh, letter to Dr. Alphys? <laughs> Why don't I do it myself? I didn't ask anything, and no. It seems that now you are a pacifist, child! So here's a list of things to do! Here's a piece of celery to write it down! Yeah, I usually use carrots instead of celery for my writing needs. So first thing's First, have a date with Undyne. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What is it with you guys on dates? Yeah, you're making me timid. Then deliver her letter to Alphys. Then you can meet me at my house for some fun. That is not going on the list. Whatever you do, do not read the letter. Da, I just. Da, 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 da. Hey! What does it say, child? La la la. Something about Undyne's tongue and Alphys. Stop! Alphys's... You're embarrassing me. But I'll see you at my place later, all right? Do I have a choice? Well, you could hang out with me. Yeah, I'm going. Hello, child. How'd you get here so fast? Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? Why is her house like an evil fish? Because she's a fish, obviously. God, are you an idiot? That's actually very offensive coming from you. Here, Undyne loves these. She does. Oops, wrong present. <laughs> this thing. That's even worse. <laughs> Let's just get this over with. Oh, hey, Papyrus, you coming in? Oh, it's a genderless child. Now I'm all nervous and flustered. Come on in. Oops, just realized I must go to the bathroom. I have a giant turd on the way. Before I go, though, the child brought you this. Uh, thanks. Apparently you love it. I don't love it. Yeah, I didn't think so. I'll go put this with the others. So, uh, we're gonna become friends. You're my battlefield now. Is that why there's a dead body over there? <laughs> Whoops. There we go. So we're gonna be friends, and I'll tell you what's gonna happen, and I'm being very assertive to hide my insecurities. Great, all the wonderful traits I love in women. Take a seat. In what, the fish bowl? No, the chair, doll. So how often do you have people over then? Not too often. Oh, really? I assumed you'd be a hit with the big fish out there. You know, there's plenty of fish in the sea, as they say. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, great. So how do you pick up guys then? Do you just go to a river and say, yeah, and the fish jump out at you. That's not how it works. Then you go to a pet store and look at all the goldfish. What would you say is the hottest fish you've ever had sex with? That's a personal question. It's Finding Nemo, like porn for you. This is my date, and I'm gonna tell you what's happening here. What's this room? That's my room. No nerds allowed. So then why are you in there? What? I'm going in. No, no, don't! <laughs> I just cleaned that yesterday. Sit down, enjoy my spear! Whoa. Are you hitting on me? You wish. You're hitting on me. <laughs> to show you my personality! Yeah, your kitchen's on fire. I can't help it, I just have so much personality! Oh, hopefully if I just sit here, she'll burn alive. What? I said hopefully you'll burn alive! Oh, you're funny. I'm serious. How's the days going, friends? I wasn't touching myself in the bathroom! I wasn't! Well, that was the worst experience of my life. Hey, man. Oh, God. You aren't going to ask me out on a date, are you? Uh, no, no. Why would I do that? Unless you want to, of course. Why is everybody down here obsessed with dates? And I don't mean the food kind. Am I right, lads, or am I right, lads? What? 
Where is he? You are right, lad. Cheers, lad. Where were you, lad? Sorry, lad. I was busy, lad. That's all right, lad. I won't let you down again, though, lad. Appreciate that, lad. See you, lad. Uh, anyway, you want to hear my mixtape? I'm an aspiring musician, you see. Yeah, those headphones don't give it away. You should come back to my house. Is this a regular thing down here? I swear I've been to every house in this entire underground at this point. Yeah, but you ain't been to my house. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Come on, I'll show you my music. I guess I could put it on my nice list. What are you, like Santa Claus? Yeah, I'm his Padawan learner. Next week, he's going to teach me how to enslave elves. Also, don't steal the sarcastic jokes. That's my job. My bad. Can I actually go inside you? Not, not like that. Huh? Because you're a ghost, right? <laughs> this is awesome. Look at this. What's wrong? You sound like he's shitting out a melon. It hurts, man. Just imagine me putting my hand in your insides and then squeezing them. That's how it feels. So if I did this. Does that hurt? I'm about to start doing this. Wait, here's my place. Looks very serial killer-ish. Are you a serial killer? <laughs> I wish. Help me! <laughs> that was my friend. She practices her acting in that room. Yeah, well, that was almost Oscar worthy. Well, go on then. Show me this amazing mixtape. I uh, call this one the Ballad of the Ghosty Man thing. It's a very emotional song, you know? Mm, yeah, sounds it. Here comes the best part now, this bit. Show me how much you love me. I love poo. So what do you think? Lyrics are on point, beats quite nice, very emotional, very refreshing, you know, new genre of music I'd feel. Oh yeah? Yeah, be shit. Literally. Thanks. Just not sure about the lyrics, you know? Oh, you want lyrics? I'll show you some lyrics, man. Try this on for size. It's a new contemporary thing, you know? Yeah? I call it gibberish but with a J. Ah. I said the files to your phone. Nah, it's fine, mate. I really you don't. Ugh, well, time to burn this phone. I'm gonna go now, ghost guy. See ya. <laughs> I never get tired of that. Good luck with your acting career. <laughs> what even is this? Oh, oh, hey, genderless child. How are you doing? I missed you. Did you miss me? Definitely not. Oh, it's like a little reunion. <laughs> Feels more like a bakery to me. You know, those photos you took of me from Monstergram? I got two likes on one of them. One of those likes was Barry. <laughs> this is Barry, by the yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, I got that. My photo is not all he likes. <laughs> well, I'm glad I got you a nice snail boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Near boyfriend. <laughs> We're just friends. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Dating in 2016 sure has taken a fine turn. You gotta be a nice person, because if you don't... Gotta, gotta be gonna... nice, yes! Yeah. I got it! I am dying inside. <sighs> Hi, Barry, I'm Genderless Child. Nice to meet you. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? I think he likes you. Yeah, a bit too much, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Yep, definitely likes you. So Barry's son is competing in the snail race today. Is it a race against who can be the most vile? Because Barry definitely takes the cake and the bacon and the cherry on top all in one mouthful. And he didn't even use a spoon. He says thank you. Of course he would take that as a compliment. There's a prize pool of 10,000 gravities. Barry's son is going to win. And then we're going to head up the casinos in Vegas, baby. Oh, I want 10,000 gravities. I'll be, I'll be. <laughs> this one will do. <laughs> So from now on, your name is Genderless Snail. Yeah, I know, it's a great name, I made it myself. I'm gonna train you so hard, you might possibly bleed, probably death will occur. Yeah, I'm sure that sounds really messed up to you right now, but think of it as Pokemon. You're a Pokemon, you're my Pokemon, I'm your trainer. I wanna be the very best, no one ever was. Got it? That is a definite yes. Submitting this to the FBI? Oh, I've heard of them. No, you haven't. No, I haven't. What a riveting conversation. I hope you're ready to go. Because it's time to get it on. I'm ready to die of boredom. So to participate in this race, that'll be 10,000 to one crabbities, please. Whoa, 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 whoa. 10,000 to enter the race. Yeah. But the price is 10,000, right? Yeah. But it's 10,001 to enter the race. Yeah. Can you see how that would be a problem? Yeah. Look, I'm running a business here, man. I ain't see you buying any of my mixtapes. Bye-bye, Vegas.
Sad Sashmi. How about 10 gramities entry? I'm not surprised. Nine gramities. Do you not see how that makes no sense? Yeah, but from a business perspective, it's genius. Place your snails. Right then, genderless snail. I believe in you. You can't lose. No, seriously, you can't lose, because if you do lose, you will die. I will crush you. Good luck, have fun. Go! Yeah! Um. So who won? I don't know. Okay, I'm out of here. How's it going, Noisy McNoise Pants? Excellent nickname. I came up with that all by myself. And when I say myself, I mean my group of writers, like ten of them. <laughs> How's it going, Noisy McNoise Pants? I'm guessing that's my new nickname now. As you can see, it's catching on. <laughs> Spreading faster than chlamydia. Got a rear in my case. To be fair, I can relate to that. What are you guys talking about? So, child, are you going to show us how nice you've become? I don't know, let's find out. Tell me a joke. With a normally large pleasure. Why did the skeleton ride a motorcycle? I don't know, enlighten me. Because he was a cool dude. Ha 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 ha. See, look at that fake laughter. Look how nice he's become papyrus. He's giving me a boner. <laughs> what? Oh, that's kind of funny because you're a skeleton. What? What's funny? I don't get it. Oh, I mate behind you. It's a jelly thing. Not a fan of his jiggling, though, I'll be honest. This is your chance to prove yourself, Nicington. Give it a sexy wiggle. Whoa, whoa, man. I don't want to give it some weird vibes, man. What if it thinks I'm interested or something? I don't want to deal with a little jelly baby. I'll wiggle for you if you want me to. Why is everyone down here so weird? Like, you're a skeleton. Why are you trying to fuck a weird, genderless child like me? I don't understand. Stop yelling at me! Mate, be nice. I'm trying to be nice, but... <sighs> you guys are going to give me an angerism, I swear to God. Am I doing it right? Is this it? Um, is this the one? Is this the wiggle you're looking for? Yes. Yes, lads. Let's wiggle like a little bitch. Wiggling. Wiggling. That doesn't even sound like a word anymore. Okay, so can we start wiggling now? I don't know. I mean, usually she run away now because you are showing mercy on him, but it's not doing anything. Try talking to it. Uh, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Hello? I'm going to kill you. Okay, you just heard that, right? Sorry, too busy wiggling. I'm gonna rip off your feet. Okay, I'm calling the police. Mate, you gotta be nice to it. Wiggling does not mean niceness. It's threatening to kill me. Oh, well, I solve this predicament easily. Hey, Mr. Jelly Wiggle, mate. I'll ask you a series of questions, right? Wiggle once for yes, twice for no. What is your favorite color? How's it gonna wiggle yes or no to that? Don't interrupt me, mate, when I'm doing this. This is important interrogation. No, it's worse. We're all still wiggling right now. And we're still doing it. Still doing it. All right, question two. Do you like monster trucks? <laughs> he said no. Kill him, lads. Die, 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 die. High five. Yes. Well, that's not fair. You can kill things, but I can't. Nah, mate. He deserved to die. I mean, who doesn't like monster trucks? What a fucking goon. Pure evil. He deserved to die. You're just mad because he wouldn't go on a date with you. Speaking of dates, I've got to give this letter to Alphys anyway, so I'll see you later. Hopefully not. Never. Kill me. I just realized I don't even like monster trucks. <laughs> <laughs> Bonus. What am I now, the goddamn postman? Okay. Hmm. This is a clear predicament. Well, nothing left to do now but burn it. <laughs> this is my life right now. Sorry, it's not burning. <laughs> but that could just be my burning passion for anime. God, I forgot how much I hated you. Look, just take this letter and leave me alone. Letters? <laughs> like the alphabet? <laughs> No, I'm losing the will to live. La 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 la. <laughs> oh, is this a joke? What, your life? If so, then yeah, it's a bad one. Did you write this letter? No, I didn't. I had no idea you wanted to make love to me like this. <sighs> Excuse me? This is right here. I would have penetrated every orifice with my plastic dildes, including the ears and nostrils. <laughs> yeah, there's been a mix-up here. It wasn't actually- One second, bear me. <sighs> that means bear it back by the way in case you didn't know that. I did know that. You're so smart. Uh, that's how I look. Fucking awful. My friend helped me pick up the stress. Was your friend blind? Uh, well, I'm gonna give you some items to increase your affection stats. Is this your way of trying to get me drunk? No! Is this roofied? Maybe a little bit. <sighs> Can you not? Uh, do, do, do you like anime? Sure. Really? Oh my god, me too. I got an idea. Let's go to the garbage stub. Great, my natural habitat. I can be surrounded by all my family. You're so funny. What if I was being serious? What if I'm a dumpster baby? That's kind of hot. I just can't win. So this is where me and Undyne come all the time. <laughs> to do what? Well, we've said here. <laughs> um... Yeah, yeah. What a friendship. <laughs> Is it undying? I don't know, but hopefully she's taken out the un part of her name and actually died. Am I right, lads, or am you I right, right lads? Lad. What are you doing, lad? <laughs> Fucking hell. It's not difficult, lad. Just wait till I finish my sentence, lad. I'm sorry, lad. You're the worst type of lad. Just get out, lad. Okay. Get out. 
Lad, lad, lad. So if you deliver that letter, I might stab you in the face, because that's a really bad idea. Oh, too late. You're already dead. Yeah? Have you seen her? Unfortunately, yes. Well, I'm gonna keep looking. This is like high school drama bullshit. That I love undyed. She's so smart and confident and hot and got really nice scales. <sighs> scales, the best trait of any woman. Look, Alphys, I know you fancy Undyne. I think she wants you to sing as it says she wants to put her tongue in your bum hole or whatever it says. So, Undyne! Yeah! Oh, hi, hi, Undyne. For God's sake, just kiss. There you go. <laughs> this is kind of disturbing, actually. Hello, friends. I'm here for no reason. Now I'm going. Bye-bye. Yeah, I gotta go, too. Well, I guess I'll go, too. <sighs> By the way, before I go, is the enemy real? No. No! I don't want to live anymore! <laughs> yes! Uh, there is a god! Oh, shit. I can't die yet. You're gonna need me around for the pot. <sighs> there you go. I'll patch up. I'll see you later. <sighs> There is no God! All I want is food and a massage. How about you? You want to give me a massage? Yes! You know what? Never mind. Oh. Hello? Hello, chum! What is so important you have to call me? Especially since you're right next to me, pretty much. Yeah, I can see you. Look, do you see me waving? And now you're waving back, okay. Seeing as you're my good friend who really trusts me... That's a bit of a stretch, but go on. You should go pay a visit to our mutual friend, Lisa Simpson! Why are you still talking on the phone? Just go to her lab! House! Sex dungeon. That legit sounds like the worst idea ever. Why would I want to do that? Because I have good feelings about this! That means nothing to me. Just do it to progress the story, Jesus! Making me break the fourth wall and shit! If I have to. So you're gonna hang up now, or shall I? Let's play a game! Let's see who doesn't hang up first! I think I definitely win in this situation. Robbity -dobbity. Hey, how's it going, my work partner who I did not steal money from? As long as you're keeping the gravity safe, labbity dabbity. Labbity dabbity. I got bored of Chalala. My dead wife was not a fan. Well, I would hope so, because that would be really weird if she was a cooling appliance. Oh, she is. Excellent. Take me to Hotland. Labbity babbity. I mean, labbity da. La. La. Shit, I forgot what my catchphrase was. Was it labbity dabbity? Labbity dabbity. There we go. <laughs> Uh, I don't want to come across like I'm really needy and weird or anything. I mean, you don't come across as any of those things, but mongoloid for sure. Can I get an advance on my grampities? Uh, see, I would, mate, but I did deposit the money in a bank, and when I say bank, I mean my asshole. Oh, cool! You're very gullible, aren't you? Yes. You have no idea what that is, do you? I have no idea what that is, no. Basically, it means no. Well, I'm sorry, but I can't take you to Hotlands. Please? Damn it! My weakness! Manners! Fine, I'll take you there. Labbity dabbity dabbity! It was labba labba dabbity. Labbity! No, who fucking cares? Hello? Jurassic Park extra? <laughs> I like that one. Oh, that door is definitely inviting me in. Oh, what is this? A note from Alphys. Well, this is very out of character. Surely you should call me or text me or leave a massive Facebook essay about this. But a note on the floor? What is happening to the world? Let's read this in my head in Alphys' voice. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, never mind. Blah, blah, blah. Go indoor. Progress the plot. Da, 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 da. Thanks for the help with Undyne. She can quack like a duck when she sucks and fart on my... What the... Okay, I'm done. A nice little respite. No skeleton weirdos to annoy me. Just solace. Warning! Warning! Losing power! Of course. Altitude dropping faster than your panties! Oh, jeez, that's pretty fast then. Elevator about to fall! Falling! Still falling! <sighs> That size my last breath of giving a shit. Please scream for a dramatic effect! Oh, I guess I have to now. Ah! 